This is the most evil man in Indiana. Joseph Edward Corcoran was 16 years old when his parents, Jack and Catherine Corcoran, were shot and killed in April 1992. Joseph was arrested for their murders. Authorities believed he killed his parents because they were too strict. He went to trial, facing life in prison, but he was acquitted. The jury didn't believe there was enough evidence. His family believed in his innocence and stuck by him. By 1997, he, his brother James, his sister Kelly Nieto, and her fiancé Robert Turner were all living together. On July 26, 1997, Timothy Bricker and Doug Stilwell were visiting James. Joseph believed they were talking negatively about him, so he confronted them. He knew he was about to kill, so he took his seven-year-old niece upstairs before returning to kill his brother along with Turner, Bricker, and Stilwell. After the quadruple murder, he went to a neighbor and asked them to call authorities. He turned himself in when police arrived at the scene. When police searched his room, they found 30 guns, explosives, and books on military tactics. Prosecutors offered Corcoran the opportunity to plead guilty to the four murders and serve life without parole, but he declined the offer. He went to trial and claimed insanity, but he was forced to withdraw his claims after court-appointed doctors ruled he was not insane. A jury of his peers convicted him of four counts of murder and sentenced him to death. He is expected to be executed on December 18, 2024.